And tonight, with the flyers still forcing thousands from their homes, a popular El Dorado County tourist spot is ready to get back to normal. Apple Hill, just a few miles away from the evacuation zone, is welcoming back visitors this holiday weekend. Yeah, some are excited, but others say it's too soon. CBS 13's Laura Haefeli is live in Apple Hill with the tourism tug of war there. Laura. Every year, visitors come to Apple Hill to welcome in the beginning of autumn picnic tables like this typically full, but this year is going to be a little different with the Caldor fire burning nearby. Evacuees finally allowed to come home aren't sure if they're ready to get back to normal. Apple Hill in autumn, a time-honored tradition, is ready to open for fall festivities once again. There's so many things they could do here by just enjoying this beautiful place. Families pick apples, eat pie, and welcome in the cooler weather. But the nearby town of Pollock Pines is just starting to recover from the heat of the Caldor fire. It's just, it's just kind of weird coming back in. Just... Cindy Kellogg's home after two weeks and barely settled in. Kind of walk in circles for a little bit first. Not quite ready for tourists to turn her town upside down. It just seems like that's a little bit too soon for the homeowners that are just getting home. It would just be hard to see everybody kind of just going about their business. And Concerned evacuees will be bumper to bumper along Highway 50, making their lives even more difficult. It builds up a ton of traffic. We know it's not going to cause uh, uh, jams for the people going back home. And stuff. Apple Hill Growers Association want, President Chris Delfino says he's thinking about evacuees and local farmers who've been hit hard by wildfires as well. And as a farmer, we deal with freezes in the, in the winter. I mean, in the spring, we deal with hail in June, and it can wipe out a whole crop, but we deal with fires in the fall. Thousands of jobs. Um, this this farm alone it brings in, and that really helps keep people, a lot of them afloat during this hard time. How important is tourism to the Northern California economy? So we have to have Labor Day forward until Christmas. If we don't, we don't exist, and then these farms don't make it. It's one of the oldest apples there is. It's so much fun. You can go fishing, you could go play games, there's caramel apples. Displaced by the Caldor fire for two weeks, Ariana Anton's back home, and she's excited to hit Apple Hill and put the Caldor fire in the past. You know, everybody can go and have fun and not think about it. Now, Apple Hill will be fully open this Labor Day weekend. We're told none of the farms are in evacuation zones. The president of the association tells us they will be donating apples, apple products to local food banks in hopes of helping evacuees.